and you, and you, and you. So first night in Uti. Um, we are staying here. Uh, Fort Simona. Very, very cold. Well, let's just say I think both of us have had enough of feeling cold. Uh -huh. uh, ironic really, because about three weeks ago, I uttered the words, I miss feeling cold, didn't I? Yes, you did. I miss feeling cold. That's and what I was I not said. happy about that when you said those words. After about 50 days of sweating like a priest in a wetsuit at choir practice, we decided to go up the mountains into the cold and um, the novelty wore off pretty quickly. Very quickly. Um, so what we're going to do now, we're going to go have some food and... Uh, go explore Woodsy in time that we have left here before returning to our cold, cold Dubais. So yeah, so let's go see Uti. Yay! Hopefully Uti your lake will be prettier than Padai Canal. Give me an O. Oh. Give me an Uti. Uti. What does this spell? Uti. Oh, I had an accident. I cut my finger open. Um, <laughs> probably right down to the bone. Uh, whilst trying to repair our backpacking washing line. Um, what do you think about my finger? It's injured. Injured. Injurious. Injurious. <laughs> Repairing backpacking washing lines can be injurious to your health, as you can see. Well, if you, use, if you don't know how to use an arm and eye. <laughs> oh, and this is Uti. It is pretty. However, what I must say about my um, broken finger issue is that Simona is an amazing nurse. So thank you very much Found Corporation for the first day training because 60 days traveling, 61 days so far traveling, I've needed about four or five repair jobs. So um, yeah, thank you Found. Just thinking about my finger. Now, if I do develop gangrene, and they have to chop it off. Um, did you know it's covered in our travel insurance? Is it? Yeah, we get like £10,000 for a lost digit. <laughs> <laughs> Is that what your plan was all along? I don't know, but come on, gangrene! <laughs> Uti Lake. Oh, I don't know. If it... Is it Uti Lake? You got some uh, pronto on your lips there. Uti Lake? Yes. Ah, very much so. Uti Lake. Um, yeah, it beats uh, Kadai Lake, that's for sure. A lot more scenic. Prettier. So we're just walking. And, yeah, uh, we don't, minding our own business. And then we noticed um, some Indian ladies running to someone's house. And like, why? What's going on? And they shout at us, don't go there. Don't go there. And then we look around the corner. It's only a bison. Uh huh. So my legs it just left me there. Um, but I managed to capture some footage of this um, holy bison. Also, just mind you, we are obviously now wearing the. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh, what do you think about that? Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, but that's a bull. Doesn't matter. No. Cool. Well, I for one like the bison. Um, someone else, I'm not mentioning any names, didn't. Safety first. And uh, it's such a beautiful thing. Uh, um, the guy that runs the boathouse said uh, it was an old bison. Um, the Indian ladies who warned us not to walk down the road. Don't go there. Don't go there. Don't, it's not racist, I'm Indian. Um, <laughs> They didn't like it either, but I thought it was an handsome beast. Um, one that I wanted to go pet and touch and milk, but um, Simona done let me. So thanks, Simona, ruining my Indian adventure. How am I ever? Milk.
how am I ever going to get closer to my ancestry if you don't let me do Indian things? Like I didn't see anyone else going to stroke him. I just want to go stroke the bison. Ooh, bison. Ooh. Cuckoo, cuckoo. Cuckoo, tell me about your life. Yeah. Made new friends yet again. For the last 15 minutes, just came from someone's gated home territory. And that's it. Just keeps following us. I think they're keeping us safe from all the deers around in the deer park that we are approaching. We approached. We approached Ted. Nobody knows. But the dogs are here. They lead the way. <laughs> That's what I've eaten. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, right. So, one day in Uti. Uh, it's a quick stopover for us on our way to Mysore. Mysore. Finger. <laughs> no, are you laughing? I like it. <laughs> cool. uh, we didn't really go anywhere. We just uh, walked around the lake, which is about. But then, however, we still have done about 20,000 steps. Yeah, so it's so. a long walk. We uh, went to the lake boathouse, which is cheesy and. Uh, the worst hmm. horror house ever. <laughs> horror house in the world um, we walked up a little bit went to the honeymoon honeymoon boathouse uh, which is deserted no but, one's uh, there but except the cashier but the, but the single most best highlight of Uti was the magnificent bison that wanted to kill us yeah Ah. Oh. Yeah. That was an experience. Oh, I was just in the middle of the road. Ready to charge us with our red and pink attire. That was a glorious beast. One was truly humbled in his presence. Wasn't one. Wasn't two. No, because one ran away. <laughs> <laughs> so only one was... Humble, the other one, <laughs> literally. Let's do that. Then we went to this nice little park. Went to a nice little park. Cleanest park we found hard so far. Hard to call, hard to color. Yeah. Which is nice. Went to a coffee house. Made new friends. Made who? The dogs. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Made uh, friends with Bebop. And rock steady. Mm -hmm. uh, what else we Checked out the bazaar, main bazaar. It was bazaar. Uh, yes. And then we. We bought some homemade chocolate. Had some ice cream. Had some ice cream. Serena had vegan ice cream. I oh, know. Case. Um, and then we stopped off a few more places. And we bought a refillable bottle of water. And we bought a uh, a metal water container, which can hook onto our bags. Backpack. So. Thanks, Osprey. Thanks, Osprey. Um, yeah. So that was Uti. What are you doing? Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? It's that way. Where? <laughs> oh. Where oh, Okay. Hi, dog. Yeah? Yeah, I haven't finished yet. I'm going. Oh, we'll finish this later.
snooze, snooze, snooze.